Hey everybody, my name is Kevin and welcome back for another video of Far Cry 6. We're gonna start this brand new uh, series, I guess, boys. I said another video, but it's a brand new video. Uh, brand new, starting this brand new series for you guys. Brand new game came out uh, as I'm talking right now. Oh, Shakira is in this? Don't tell me it's the same Shakira I know, but uh, okay, that's interesting. We're about to have a... If it's uh, literally Shakira, we're about to have a lot of... Uh, copyright issues boys but i'm really excited to play this game for you really excited boys uh, i've really enjoyed playing uh the fifth one i think the fifth one was uh kind of good really good so i'm excited for this one plus it has uh esposito in it which is uh, uh obviously a great uh a great uh, actor this guy right here he's a great actor boys i love them from um i love is uh, gustavo fring a character and stuff like that so obviously uh, i'm really excited for this game and him having uh, him as an antagonist is only going to make it uh, better so let's just jump into the game boys and have a lot of fun let's see what it's all about My true Yarens, I stand before you armed with truth. For too long, our country was stolen by politicians. But you elected a vision, a cure, a road to paradise. Viviro, created by our own brilliant scientists, the most effective treatment for cancer the world has ever seen, grown within our precious tobacco, modified with the purest fertilizer, Viviro, is the key to rebuild paradise. But our paradise comes at a cost. This our enemies will never understand. Yara did not elect me to do what's easy, but to do what's right. And so, with renewed focus, I must extend the draft to paradise. True Yarans from across our island, chosen to produce Enough Viviro to heal the world and save our country. These lucky Yarans will be chosen by random lottery. Even my own son Diego will be drafted tomorrow. Hey Danny. And like a true Yaran, he Turn will that shit off. with a smile on his face. Precisamente. Exactly what Castillo wants. Enough politics, Lita. You think the draft is only taking true Yarans? It's the outcasts, the poor, orphans like us. He's bringing slavery back from the dead. In Yara, you can't run from this. Hang on, you ditched us. Ran off to the jungle with a bunch of guerrillas. Leave her path. Hmm? And you're back here to recruit for Clara Garcia's local crusade? Come on, this is our big goodbye. Danny, fucking say something. All right, so we got to choose our character or something. Select the character. So let's see really quick. So who do we want to be, boys? Uh, Danny or uh, uh, Rohab, I guess. Or do we want to be this character, Danny Rohab? Okay, so it's Danny Rohab no matter what. So we're either a guy or a girl right here in that situation. I want to be a guy uh, just to connect way more with the character and stuff like that. So I guess I'll be a guy. I uh, more often than not play as a girl when... Uh, I play MMOs anyways, so I think this time around I'll, I'll go actually stick with a guy. Plus, if I'm gonna be in a some sort of survival mode or survival game, might as well be a guy. He's got go more uh, more chance of surviving, boys. That's all I'm saying. You're trained. Would have been career military if you weren't such a fuck up. <laughs> Just come with us, Lita. Aye. You never fucking listen, Danny. Hey, time to go. 
Boss waiting. Eat drinks in Mexico. Dinner in Miami. Coño! Fucking blackout. Too big for a blackout. Fucking packet? Oye! Oh, yeah. What's going on? Damn, that's rough. It's time to go, boys. We're about to get uh, fucked in here, man. We gotta go in quick. Do we even have any guns or anything? Okay, so that's how I crouch. How do I? Okay, they're gonna come by. You are unarmed. Stay out of sight and, uh, until you find any soldiers. Uh, or you wanna find soldier soldiers, I guess, boys. So if I'm careful enough, if I keep crouching, I should be all right, right? Hide behind uh, everything and stuff. So. Uh, stealth, so watch the detection meter and stay out of sight. Yeah, I don't have any weapons right now, so it's not like I can attack them or anything. If they see me, they shoot me straight like that. Where are they at? They're right there, okay. I legit don't know how we're gonna get down there without anybody noticing me. We can't be that sneaky, uh, uh, can we? Okay, there's a guy, there's a soldier right there, boys. A whole revolution going by, boys. I wouldn't really call that a revolution, but okay. Okay, there we go. So we're here. Hopefully he doesn't turn around or they don't turn around. I gotta go through here. Now, we're just lucky enough that they're dumb and stupid and they don't look behind them and stuff. But here we are, boys. All right, so we're back here again, boys. We're gonna wait for him to interact with this. There we go. He's leaving now. So now it should be good. We gotta move. Yeah, we gotta move, all right. Now these guys are gonna notice me, man. There's no way. I already got noticed multiple times. Guy right here. If I just walk, they should be okay. Let me uh, just go through here. There we go. We made it past this play at this point. This should be a, uh, uh, now an auto save or something. Get to the sewers. I can try and get there, man. The, the first act of this game, or the prologue, I guess. It's literally me running around and not trying not get detected, which is the worst thing ever. You already know I'm not a stealthy guy. Alright, so run. I gotta run. Okay. Let's run, boys. There we go. We finally know how to run, I guess. So now we're running through there. Go, go, go. We're running. Go, 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 go. Alright, we're good. Now we're in the sewers, though. What the fuck do we do now? Where do we go? Yo, this shit is going wild real quick, boys. I imagine I gotta go through that place. I imagine I gotta follow the path, boys. Now, I have a bunch of stuff equipped so that I, in this game already so that I can actually know where I'm going and stuff like that. Now, it's telling me the objectives and stuff, so. Is there enemies down here? I don't know. There's not even enemies down here. We're just seeing from the back. We're just hearing stuff from the, uh, from the top. Uh, basically, I, I still got Lita with me, I think, but I don't have time to look back, so No time for that, boys Let's just keep running All right, let's go, boys. We're almost there. Oh There's guards right here Let's get the fuck out of here Qu uh, quick before they know this we're here. I cannot see anything. It's so dark in the sewers It's unbelievable Holy shit, it's dark, boys. All right, we're good. Let's take the ladder already. Take the ladder and uh, see if we're gonna pay pass this place. This guard's right there. Dead end. Dead end? Can I not jump? Is there not a jump button or something? Okay, watch out now. How do we... There's a ladder right here, actually. Let's take the ladder. Because I think that's the path we're supposed to take. He's climbing real fast. He's super... Like, he's super... Uh... Okay, there we go. 
super um, speedy on that one. So we can actually do some parkour now, I'm guessing, or what? We can jump on places. Okay. Let's go up, boys. Let's jump. Just like that. Look at this place. It's falling apart, boys. This whole place is falling apart. Oh, wait. What? The zip line? Oh, shit. When am I gonna have a weapon so I can start shooting at people? You know, that's my, uh, more of my style. Oh, what the fuck was that? That scared the shit out of me. Don't make a move. We're gonna be fine. I know I just intruded in your place. It's okay. Uh, I think I'm supposed to go through here, boys. The path is literally like... It's super clear where I'm supposed to go. It's pretty easy to figure it out right now. Alright, let's go then. Is there anybody that's gonna notice me? I don't think so. I think we're gonna be fine. Let's take the zip line again. We got all these. We're all gonna die. There ain't nothing I can do about that. Let's take the ladder again. Yo, I'm sliding down there. Yo, I'm a, I'm a pro at this shit, boys. Yeah, the military is the police, my guy. What the fuck are you talking about? Military police, the MPs, that's what they are. What are you talking about? Alright, we gotta go. Alright, shit, uh, run, boys. Run for your goddamn life. The, the chopper is right there too. I don't know uh, how did they know know this us or anything. There's other people are still alive. Okay. Oh shit! This truck's everywhere. Where do we go from there, though? I'm supposed to go down there. Okay. Well, let's go, boys. Then let's take the boat. Always making new friends. Danny, you're late. Where's Alejo? Give up his ticket. For his family. Bullshit. Alejo is an orphan. Alejo's not going anywhere anymore. Come on, Marco. Let them on. Vamos. Goodbye. Get on the fucking cow. Here, it's all I've got. This isn't right, Danny. We should be fighting, not running to the young keys. Alejo gave you a fucking gift, Ita. We survived. Same as the orphanage, same as the academy. What's that? Please, no, no, this is a pity boat. You be on, no, no! was El Presidente. Mi papa loved to fish. We would go out on a boat, just like this. And we would catch the fish, and then release them. He would say it's not always about your stomach, mijo. It's about the challenge. Except when he caught a big, fat, juicy marlin. <laughs> he was too proud to let that fish go. You have boys and yada, you have boys and your sword! I have caught a very big fish today. Haven't I, Diego? Diego! No way. I have caught you, Mijo. Now it's time to bring you home. I don't want this anymore, Papa. We have no choice. Let them go. They can work. Make Viviro. Truth or lies? Truth. They could be good workers. They could help rebuild paradise. But if you wanted them to live, you would have never set foot on this fucking boat. 
13 years old. And Diego has such compassion for his people. These fish, we will catch and release. I can't feel my legs. Fuck. This is all my fault. My phone. Yeah, forget it, Lita. My phone. This is the beach, Danny. It's fucking fate. What? She's hiding here. Clara. Libertad. Julio. Fuck. Julio. It's all here. Take my phone. Follow the code like when we were kids. Stop, Elita. Just wait. I'll find help. No. You give her this. Clara will help you. Don't you get it? You're the lucky one, Danny. You're the lucky one. Lo siento, Lita. Well, we got a weapon now. At least we got a machete, boys. Unfortunate that the girl died. So That's bad. not the girl. Where the, where the fuck is she? Gone. I don't know where her, her body is. I should look for supplies That's not her. 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 And where the fuck is she? I don't know how, where her body went, boys. But uh, she's dead. So I'm alone now inside search zone. So we're starting our brand new survival adventure, boys. Let's figure it out. Uh, how the fuck do I equip my weapons or whatever? What is this? Collect. We already got some loot. Wait, what? A pistol? What the fuck? Empty bullets, though. So no bullets, boys. That's great. Lita's phone has uh, a photo, which will help me find the place, I guess. What type of fucking photo is this? So we got to find... Oh, okay. And there we go. So I got the marker on my minimap. And so the minimap is very small. Holy shit. Very small minimap. I might change it. Oh, there's some uh, enemies down here. I may, I might change the minimap to upgrade it. To up it up a little bit. Look at that. That's kind of cool. All right. Let me uh, change the minimap really quick, actually. The, the thing. Oh, I went into the menu. So you can see that's how it works. Inspect. So you can craft your weapons and stuff like that, obviously. So it sounds good enough. You've got obviously your gear and stuff. Hopefully it doesn't affect. Uh, I think it just affects how you look. So I think it's just cosmetic. Which I, I prefer to having something more RPG like. I prefer having something that's more cosmetic. Uh, inventory. So we've got the camp resources. All that good stuff. Collection system. There it goes. That's what I want to do. So options. Let me go into options. Gameplay. Let me see real quick. All right, boys, so I went ahead and uh, changed it. So already we can tell it's a lot bigger now. So you can already tell it's a lot bigger now. Uh, the uh, UI and stuff. So you can see properly what's going on. Uh, if we go inside right here, we can't really... Okay, yes. I can uh, literally go there. So can I swim there? Oh, um, use my sh machete. Okay, so I can break this if I use my machete. Uh, collect the parts. So we got some parts here and there. 
So that's how I uh, attack somebody is by using that. Uh, so we got a bunch of them. We got some enemies down here. I'm not sure. I'm not sure where we're supposed to go. There's some enemies right here. Better stay quiet. Yeah, I don't know who's shooting right now, but we got to be quiet. We're actually being quiet is not really my uh, my type, but we'll try to be it stealthy right now, way. I guess. This has to be the way. I don't really like the 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 upgraded UI though. I don't like it. I think I prefer a smaller UI, boys, but the problem is if I try you uh, another UI uh, the other one, I can't see shit. I just really can't see anything, boys, so... Uh, I guess I'm gonna stick to that for now. Is there... Is that the only guy? I guess machete kill? Wh wait, what? What the fuck was that? That was the worst attempt of a machete kill ever, boys. What the fuck was... What? Okay. Enough, buddy. Got you. Okay, alright, alright. Where the fuck is the other dude? Got you, bitch. There we go. Shot him. Dead in the act. The now these guys, so I'm auto automatically gonna collect the weapons at least. That's a good thing. That was not a good one. Kind of messed up right there. My health comes back up, so interesting. So it feels like an old type of game right there. Really old style and stuff like that. Uh, Read, so refugee ship sank off. Okay, and we got some, some stuff this? to collect. What am I getting? Could be useful. Oh, some new pants. Munition pants, all right. Got you. Let me equip those really quick. Let me uh, get some better pants, I guess. Can I get rid of those? Like, see if I can equip the set or... Now, I guess I can't uh, get rid of those or anything. So, I guess I'm stuck with what I have. Let's move on, boys. Got a brand new gun. Well, not a brand new gun, but I got some ammo and I've got a machete and stuff. Alright, so change gear. I've already done that before. The fuck was that? Oh, fuck. A pig? Okay, I don't want to use my weapons or anything, so I'm just gonna keep attacking him. They're gonna gonna keep attacking the pig with, uh, I guess my machete and stuff like that. This feels already I can tell, boys. Feels a lot more old school than the previous games, which uh, I'm definitely all about the train. The, the in the train, I'm gonna hop on in that train. I mean, old school is my type of gameplay. I like that uh, type of old school gameplay where you don't have to literally be super RPG like, you know. I don't like it when it's too much RPGs. Uh, I actually like it more when you don't have to focus too much. So. Okay, let's see really quick. So is there more enemies I gotta shoot? Or never mind. I guess it's cutscene time. I'm gonna show your face before you shoot me. I'm Danny, a friend of Lita. Silencio. You are the only survivor? Answer me. I said, are you the only survivor? Si, Loki. Lita knew there is. That's all you have to say? You're here. That's what matters. Just a second, hermana. I'm getting the hell out of Yara. <laughs> but you're in my camp. I need a place to stay. A few days. Libertas no charity, hermano. Lita said you would help. Lita also said you weren't a pussy. Come mierda. <laughs> You're an orphan, see? Funny how friends can be closer than family. Remember, Danny? Castillo has kept you an orphan. Why do you want to run? I watched Castillo order a whole boat of our people shot to death. Get as far away as you can from that psychopath. All of you. <laughs> <laughs> when tyranny is law, revolution is order. Quoting Bolivar won't save you. It's Pedro Abisu. Gonna save Yara with library cards? I have a list. Free elections, free expression, free the outcasts. A Yara free of Castillos. Simple. Simple? 
Castillo's got what? 300,000 troops? I count six burnt out guerrillas and you with a bullet to the leg. You don't believe me? I'll show you. We launched an attack from our base to this island. It was a basic operation. Hit a Viviro tobacco plantation, snatch some fuel, and go home. But Castillo's forces were waiting. Got us down from 60 to 6. You need to get back to your base. Yes, but this island is surrounded by a blockade. We don't have boats, we don't have much gear. And we are not leaving until that Viviro plantation goes up in smoke. But we are guerrillas. We know this land inside out. You're already familiar with our guerrilla paths. They were built by the legends in 67. They're spread like a web across all of Yara. Now, they're ours. Guerrilla paths are good to ambush soldados or to hide if the army is on your back. They have caches that will help you survive. And all this is legit? This map is old as hell. Made for touristas. Yeah, it's out of date, but you got the regions, municipalities, and landmarks of Yara. You'll get used to it. Now I need to call in some favors with the locals to get us a boat, and you need to go find me Juan Cortez. Who? Someone who can make one guerrilla fight like a thousand. You know I'm not a guerrilla, right? Italitele? I'll give you food, a bed, even a goddamn boat to sail to the Yankees. But it's gonna cost you bullets and blood. You can shoot, so shoot. Settle in, and let me know when you want to pay your rent. Looks like she's forcing me to join her, which doesn't uh, sounds pre uh, pretty bad, as bad as the uh, as joining the other dude. Uh, so let me find out really quick what is that. And I take this. There we go. Refill my ammo really quick. Collect the scraps as well. So we get everything. We got a, a brand new weapon as well. Let me actually. Uh, we got a brand new weapon and stuff, so change it. Nope. Uh, I can't really equip any items onto it, so uh, we don't have anything that we can do. I didn't level up or anything, I think. So we don't have anything, right? There's no level up system actually in this game. Yeah, it's really old school. So there's really like no RPG elements whatsoever to this game. There is mo still multiple maps that you gotta discover, I guess. Look at all this. Th this map, oh yeah, this game's pretty huge. Is there anything for us that's waiting for us? Like anything that I can craft or or get? Doesn't seem like it. All right, doesn't seem like it. So I guess we can move there and start talking to her. I guess to do the the main quest. So uh, I'll, I'll I'll do that in the next video, boys. I guess let's read that up really quick. You guys can read that on your own free time, and uh, this one as well. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna talk to her in the next video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this one. Keep it easy.